guys, it's Izzy. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you my leather collection. So if you want to see that, then keep on watching. Alrighty, so this video is going to consist of all of my 100% leather pieces. I have um, some faux leather pieces, but I didn't want to bring that out because it didn't fit what I wanted to show you. And I'm going to say 99.2% of all these pieces I'm missing a piece, and that piece is brown, but all the other pieces are black, so that kind of, you know, opens my eye to things, but without further ado, let's get started. So, the very first piece that I was missing first, but now I have put on the rack, is this one. I think this video is very fitting because it is still winter, and if you saw my coat collection, then you'll see some of these pieces um, reoccurring again. But, this is just a 100% leather, and I might reiterate that phrase, 100% leather, all throughout the video, so don't mind that. Um, coat, or jacket, from Wilson's Leather, and I bought this from a vintage shop, vintage shop for, I think it was $30, $29, $25, something like that. Um, we're just going to round up to $30, pull up this. I wasn't going to try them on, to be honest, but what the hey? <laughs> what the hey? We're here. And this is what it looks like. Uh, I've talked about this before, but the silhouette of it is quite fantastic. And it just gives me everything that needs to be gave. Alrighty, so next up on the list is this leather mini trench or blazer, I think. It's more fitting to call it. I love this thing. I actually just added new red buttons to it because my old buttons were just falling off. And they were all different types of buttons like it was bad um so i just put some red new ones on and i absolutely love it um i'll put into the picture of me wearing it but this is thrifted i think all of my pieces are thrifted and if you're new to my channel just be used to that <laughs> like i would say a clean 70 percent of my wardrobe is thrifted which i love um but this is from the brand okay there is no brand but it is 100 percent leather yeah there's no brand and I, I don't remember, I think I paid like $15 for this, which was pretty steep. Um, but I just, I was looking for a leather blazer like this for so long that I was like, this is perfect and it's worn beautifully. I also just love to keep it tied in the back because it gives me a sort of shape. And yeah, I think this is just such a good, such a good find, such a good blazer. And yeah, the next on the list, I will not talk my head off about this one because I've spoken or spoke about this jacket for so long, so many times, it doesn't matter. Um, this baby, it's heavy, so. But it's a black leather trench. The detailing on the sleeves and the pockets are immaculate. I also love to keep this tied in the back. It gives me very much matrix and I love this coat. It is from Suburban Heritage. I bought this for, I think it was $25 at a secondhand shop in um, Chicago. Like I said, if you watch my coat collection video, then you've seen most of these items. But this stunning, like especially for $25, I think that's what I paid. Like stunning. Oh, I love this. Every time I see it, every time I pull it out, my heart just flutters and I absolutely love that for me. So yeah, let's do our very last um, jacket and then we'll go into bottoms. So last on the jacket is a, just a leather coat or a leather jacket. Your standard leather jacket, I bought this for, I want to say $25 or $20. I don't remember y'all. I really don't. Um, I got this from a thrift shop in Jersey and I love it. It's from the brand Boston Harbor. And it's just quite cool. I don't know if I have a picture with me in this, but or wearing this, but this is what it looks like. And it has these like cool um, detailing on the the shoulders that you can like undo it. It's like a button. I love this jacket. I really do like it a lot. The only thing that I wish um, this jacket had was pockets. But like that's anybody with anything that doesn't have pockets. Like why don't you have pockets? Uh, but I think it does a splendid job at first i was very hesitant to buy this leather jacket because i already had a black leather jacket um full leather but i love that jacket still have it i'm so glad i didn't get rid of it um but that one just is going to last longer obviously and i think it does add something else to the jacket that the jacket that i had before i bought that didn't have so um now we're gonna go into our last three pieces which are bottoms and then i'm finished <laughs> Alright y'all, I had to put my hair in a pony 
can tell because they're just getting aggravated. <laughs> so next on the list we have our leather pants. I had been searching for leather pants for quite some time. I really wanted to get, um, I really like to get my pieces second hand because I don't know, it just makes me feel better. So when I say I've been searching for something a long time, I mean searching for it like in the thrift or like online thrift stores versus like buying it brand new. I don't think I'll ever buy leather brand new because there's just so many good leather pieces already used that it makes no sense for me to buy it brand new. Um, and that's how I felt about these leather pants. I really wanted a specific type of fit. I wanted it to be flared or like um, boot cut. Like not just a straight skinny leather pant. And this is the one I came across. These are from the brand. Ooh, I don't remember the brand because I got them tailored and she took off the tag, which makes sense. But yeah, these were way too big on my waist. Um, so I just took them to the tailor and they fit perfectly and then I also got them hemmed and they fit perfectly now. These are low waisted but I love how they fit and I think that if you don't if you don't take away anything from this video, get yourself a leather pant. I think it will just make your life so much easier and it will elevate your looks. Um, but these leather pants I absolutely love. They're so soft and good and just everything that I wanted um, and I was sure, I was sure... I don't know what I was gonna say. Oh, sure, what? I don't know. But look, oh, let me take it off the hanger. Babes, I was just so into that monologue. <laughs> but it has like this cool little, um, like, like little, I don't know what you call that, like split type thing. Y'all, I don't know. But it's really cute. I actually got these off of Thread Up. It has some back pocket action and also some front pocket action. I got these from Thread Up and I paid a pretty penny. I think I think I pay like over twenty dollars for these, and I think that's a lot, including sh like plus shipping. That's a lot of money. <laughs> like I don't care, um, but I really wanted them, and I love them, and I think they're gonna be in my closet for a very very long time. So yeah, get yourself a leather pant because these are fantastic. <laughs> Second to last item is a leather skirt. My last item, my last item is also a leather skirt, but different. So this baby is my infamous le leather skirt that I have talked so much about that you have seen so much on my channel that I wear so much in real life. <laughs> it's this baby right here. Um, I absolutely adore this skirt. Like it's the silver um, zipper and detailing for me that makes it so freaking cool. This is my going out skirt. Like this is my eight week getting lit tonight skirt, my club skirt, like I look good skirt. Like I love this skirt. Um, this is from Zara and I, I bought this for five dollars off of Poshmark and it's probably one of my favorite Poshmark buys to to date and it is so like so soft and so good I love a like a nice worn in leather there's something about worn in leather that just makes me very happy and that's what this gives these pockets are functional which I think is absolutely incredible like a skirt with functional pockets babes what more could you want <laughs> The last piece, like I mentioned before, is also a skirt, but this is my wholesome skirt, <laughs> my work skirt, my we have a job interview skirt, and it looks like this. Um, it, it looks kind of like short on camera, but I promise y'all, it goes like right above my knees. Like it's definitely work appropriate. This is from the brand BB. I stand BB. I love me a good BB fine, and um, it has like a little uh, slit in the back so you can walk. I love this skirt. I bought this, ooh, I want to say maybe for five bucks. Do you guys remember when I bought this? Like, I have a haul on my channel when I got this, and I absolutely love it. It's that same type of worn-in leather that's just so buttery soft. Like, when I found this at the thrift, I was absolutely splendid to have come across it, and I just snatched it right up, and this has come so handy in my work wardrobe and I think I'm going to film like winter work outfits because sometimes you get into a funk but that's a different video but yeah that is my whole entire um uh 100% leather collection all right you guys I hope you enjoyed that video I definitely did I now realize that upcoming if I ever find leather pieces I really want them to be colored leather because babes this all black thing is fine listen I am a black queen but I think some pops of color and like 100% leather would be awesome so that's just a little thing to keep in the back of my head but I absolutely enjoyed filming this this of course was just my clothing pieces I of course have like leather shoes and leather bags but 
one step at a time, baby. <laughs> so thanks so much for watching this video and clicking on my face. Um, I'll see you guys in my next one. Peace and love, love and peace and everything in between. Um, bye.